Hey, it's your buddy Tim Schull, and uh, happy Friday. We are doing a Raid Shadow Legends video on shard pulls, and we're having a two times sacred event. And we have 39 shards in a dream, and I have a frosty cold beer and a couple on ice next to me. I always like to do the first one in a nice cup, and we are going to pull some legendaries here. So let's first look at the legendaries I want. It's funny, I was going through the affinities, and it's mostly uh, the magic legendaries that I want. Um, I'd love Sethalia. Septimus would be good. I'm not sure who that is. Baron? Hillior? No, I don't want Hillior. Uh, I mean, obviously, Raglan's not happening. Um, let's see. High Elves... Oh, I clicked on High Elves and I got Lizardman. Um, let's see. Shiramani would be all right. Ooh, Lysandra would be really good. I know I missed her. I know I missed her uh, 10 times event, but I refuse to pull on those anymore. Royal Huntsman would be okay. How about Sacred Order? Astralon is, is top three, probably, to pair, pair with my uh, Lix. And then Cupidus to pair with my Venus would be a top pick as well for me. Barbarians. I think there's a few barbarians. I mean, Sill, I'm obviously still waiting for. None of the barbarians. I don't really want Altan. How about Ogren? Biggin, top three. I wouldn't mind a War Mother because I kind of want to try a bomb meta with uh, Lord Shara, Sh Shazar and War Mother and Astralon. I have a couple of them. Ignatius would be good, except I already have HP Burn Champions. Uh, I have a, I'm have some Irish background, so Shamrock would be kind of a fun little meme. Lizardman, obviously Draco, top three, maybe top one. That that's it though. Fushan would be okay, I guess. Skinwalkers, no. Hawkhorn, if I had to get one. Krila, Tila, no, no, no. Iron Brago, that's probably would round out my top third, so it'd be biggin. Draco or Iron Brago. I know he was a. I know he was a. Fusion, but I missed it. Candrafon. Okay. Sorry. I, he, he's top five for sure. No. So there's a few. I have a few out there that I would still love to get. Tomb Lord wouldn't be bad. He does some fun solo stuff. Dwarves, any of the, I mean, if I pulled him, then I could keep all the, then I could keep all the, uh, the rare, or the epics in that faction. Okay, so here we go. We have 39, 39 and a dream. I think I have room, let's see. Let's see. 137. 39 to be 40, 30. Yeah, so we just have room. Okay. Just have room. Here we go. Relic Keeper. I have him. He was, I think his idea was, he had so many extra turns, I was actually going to do a video on him because I thought he could be a, kind of a Rodos type, but uh, I couldn't get him to do enough damage. But I think he was the original OG campaign farmer um look at this 40 percent increased attack in campaign battles so i mean it would be slow but he'd get through it right with all the extra hits he's doing yeah alika these folks are tough because they just use so many books oh my gosh she is a librarian look at that i built out her sister sakira i think for my faction war team, and she was pretty helpful in a stun set just because she does so much AOE. Come on, let's see the gold now. Let us see the gold. Duck, awesome champion. Awesome champion. Have him. No, I don't I don't see the reason to ever use two ducks. Armina, really, really good. Again, I don't think you need two of them. Catacomb Counselor, the OG ally attack, right? Yep. 
Just two, though. He could use a buff. Come on, baby. We are six shards in and have not seen the yellow. Burgoth the Malformed. I mean, I have him, but I never built him out. I didn't see any reason to. I think he was a fusion as well. Okay, let's see the yellow. Something good here. Yeah, Chinoro, I have her. Even one of the epics for the fusion would be super nice, right? I mean, Tyrell. I'm, you know, people love Tyrell for his defense down on a four-turn cooldown. I, I mean, I never got it. I guess he hits pretty hard. But, eh. I use him on Faction Wars just because he's one of the few defense down champs in that faction. So, Knight Errant, big single target hitter. The poor man Septimus, I think. I have him. Come on, baby. Let's see some gold now. We're 10 shards in. We are 10 shards in. Yeah, Thanoso, good healer for that for that group. I mean, I was hoping for four. Here we go. Here we go. Something good. <sighs> Skull Lord Vargal. Okay, well, he is not a dupe. So there's that. Does a decrease attack. I think if you pair him up with somebody, uh, Skull Sworn, so you can sort of run these guys in uh, the faction war, and the boss just continues to uh, to knock down Skull Sworn. He just picks him right back up. So okay, not super excited about that one. Let's get one that we're excited about. Come on, another yellow now. A chalk, obviously, S tier. Good Spider Champion if you don't have any other freeze. Put on the spiderlings with your HP burn, <laughs> Carlos. I made a, I made a video about him. Not super uh, fond of his aesthetic. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm -hmm. Caden, pretty much the only reviver in Dark Elves, I think, at least for epics. Yeah, Quargon, really, really good faction war, big healer. Does a lot of veil stuff. Man. Man, oh man. We come on. Give me that yellow. Yep, we've seen you, Sakara. Not interested. Not interested. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Gentoro. Dupe. I think I have two Gentoros. This might be my third. Yeah, I mean, okay. It is land of the dupe. I'm hoping uh, the dupe system comes out and it is robust. Ultimate Gaelic. Yeah, I mean, he's, if you don't have any other HP burn. Geomancer. Again, I mean, I actually use him on my faction war team because his turn meter control is really, really good. And, uh, yeah. So... I built him out and made fun of him in a video and ended up using him in my uh, in my uh, Faction War team because, uh, boy, his turn meter is just outstanding. Pestilus. I have Pestilus. I just never really looked at what he does. So he's support. One enemy. I mean, what? Two times at random. One enemy. HP burn. Heals allies by their HP if the HP burn is placed. Fills the turn meter. Oh, he fills the turn meter if it's not placed. I mean, eh. Okay, come on. Two more. I want two more. Come on. Yeah, and Azana. I think I built her too. I think she had some good. Yeah. I like this. I like this. Yeah, and she does all AoE stuff. So these are her two attack. This is her protect, so you can put her in a stun set, and uh, she does pretty well. She does decent damage, too. Mm, yep, yeah. Sachi, I have her. Come on. We need two more, boy. Come on, you can't pull 40 and get two legendaries. Fainia, yeah. OG, Poisoner, really good if you don't have 
one of the uh, legendary poisoners. Fergus, yeah, Solo, Scarab, God. Come on, baby. Where is the love? Where is the love? Spider. Gee, I wonder what he was used for. <laughs> Decrease defense and weaken. 60%. 70, 80, 90, 100%. On a five turn cooldown. Yeah, I mean, eh. if you didn't have any other option, and you could reset cooldowns, that wouldn't be too bad, right? Fast fear monger. Oh my gosh, come on. We are, what, 28? This will be 29 with two. We got to be getting close to the mercy, though. Sanguina, decent champion. We have got to be getting close to the mercy. Tyrell, yeah, we get you, Tyrell. We get you, Tyrell. Oh my gosh. Masked Fearmonger, mm hmm. It's a 10 times event on Masked Fearmonger, if you didn't know, so. Deathless, Renegade lookalike. 30% reflect buff on this champ. Portion of defense and increase according to the number of dead allies. Okay, interesting. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Oh my gosh, are we really going to get two? Here, something good, please. Oh, for the love of Pete, another dupe, Lord Chamfort. I use him on my faction war team, but good heavens. Are we really going to get one non dupe and it's a Skull Lord? <laughs> Oh, I love this fucking game. God bless them. Here we go. Come on. Mountain King. Well, they're Mountain King. I don't think I have my first Mountain King built as well as he could be. But solid, solid champ. I mean, he's tough to deal with if uh, you can't stop him from just rolling. Come on. So I got four. I guess I can't be too unhappy. I got, what, at least four, right? I got... Mountain King, Lord Chamfort, Gentoro. I think I got, oh, and Skullers. So I got five. Yeah, I can't be, an, and Annex, yeah. Annex is pretty good. Come on. All right. Oh, Torgi. I have Torgi. But uh, really good champ. So, yeah, no, uh, no excitement, really. Um, you know, I'm, I'm really only going to, be pulling on two times chances and really i'm looking for voids i mean i need i need siffy i need i need uh krisk i need some of the some of the uh, voids but i hope you guys have a much much better friday than i had and that your pulls go amazing and uh yeah congratulate me for the uh skull lord in the uh, comments below and uh subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done it and uh, we will see you on the next video.